guys, Cindy Otter here with my Artsy Endeavors. Um, as you see, I'm going to start a new project. These are two canvases that have so many coats of paint on them, I honestly don't know <laughs> how many. But um, they've been in my closet for so long, and I just decided I needed to do something with them. So I'm going to do a project. Um, these are the beads. If you saw my video about the beads, the jar that I got, these are the beads from it. And i got to find a container to put these in so they don't roll around. And then these, these are so cool. These are, let me find another one, uh, little tiny stars that Vicki Brown from uh, Messy Table Studios um, gave to me. And they are just so cool. And I thought, what a great idea to use them. I'm going to use them on, why am I got a shadow? That's really weird. I normally don't. Um, I'm going to use these on these canvases along with the beads. These beads I just found in a random drawer today. I didn't even know I had them. But we're going to play around with these. There's another one. Um, and see what kind of canvases we can make. And yeah, let's do it. So I'm going to go ahead and fast forward through the process. Probably sit here, watch a movie, and play. All right? I hope you guys enjoy, and I'll chat at the end. Okay, so I got my beads poured out, um, and then the rest of them are still in strings, and I'll pull those in when I want to use them. But here's what I'm thinking. These are nice and fat, right? So if I take one, let me move this over for right now. If I take one and just, it flattens. So I am thinking seriously of using one of these that is um, big. No, because I want to put a bead in the middle there. I'm seriously thinking about flattening these out and using them to make some flowers. So, Vicki, I hope you don't mind. I know you did a lot of work on keeping them puffy. But, girl, I got to flatten them. So, um, I don't mind, you know, stuff being high. I just don't like it being really high. So that's what I'm going to do. And my thought is just to do a couple um, flower, you know, a couple flowers that's hanging on here. And, you know, do some stems with my beads and, you know, centers and decorate it up real pretty. So that is my thought. Um, I'm going to go ahead and continue with this. Let me get um, these set up kind of where I want them. And... Um, I'll just stay on and I'll let you see the process of what I'm doing. All right, I'll be back.
Okay guys, so right now I have a crazy mess. Um, let me tell you, I have seed beads everywhere on my floor. Everywhere. But hey, that's the fun of creating, right? So this is the first one I did, and I actually learned a lot when I did this one. Um, right now I'm going to let it dry, and then I think I'm going to come back in, and I'm going to kind of calm down the back a little bit. Either that or do something to bring these flowers up out. So that I'm not sure yet. This one I did a little bit differently. Um, I had fun doing both of them, but like I said, at this point I want to let them fully dry and then I'll come back and we'll play with them some more. All right, chat in a bit.
Alright guys, so I think I'm done with these for now. These are, see I got, I'm going to have to put another little bit of glue in here somewhere because every now and then a seed bead will pop off. So I think I'm going to go through and glue again all my, um, use a heavy gloss and go through all my seed beads and stuff. But I don't need to do that on camera. So here they are. Um, these are the two little canvases that I created out of this big huge things of beads that I still have. So I actually have a few uh, mixed media boards by Dina Wakely here and it, they come in a pack of three. I got these at Tuesday morning and what I did is I made this little, I don't know, bead thing out of this one. So I'm thinking I'm going to do that for the rest of these. Um, 
I'm not sure yet. I'm thinking I'm, I may end up using the rest of these beads on this and just doing something fun like this on it. So anyways, I'll show you guys those later. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this. I hope you enjoyed the process. Um, like I said, the, the canvases began with all this paint on them. It's got layers and layers and layers of paint. So I just decided to put something interesting over top. All right. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. Let me bring out just a little bit so you can actually see the whole thing in my messy desk. But um, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And always, uh, don't forget to have fun. That's what life's all about, right? Happy creating. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.